I am going greyhound racing all my life, but in the last 20 years I've started to do my own. It's just part of everyday life now. Up in the morning, up in the evenings, doing the dogs. It's just something we love to do. It's the kids, it's the wife, it's loading up, it's going out, it's, it's the thrill of it, it's the fun of it. It's great to see the, the kids walking the dogs and hugging them and kissing them, do you know? Um, it's just, yeah, we love it. Uh, I love the greyhounds, it's a great hobby. I love going down like every day and just like feeding them. And it's, they're really nice and friendly. We've had them like for as long as I can remember, so like I love them so much. We have five right now, and we have Rosie, Peach, Barney, uh, Ollie, and we have Blackjack as well. Kids love the dogs, yeah, yeah, they really do. They're after getting to an age where that, you know, they can walk the dogs, they can handle the dogs more than they used to. So yeah, it's, it's like Ly Lila, when she comes home from school, I, I have to wait for her to feed the dogs because she won't let me do it myself. So yeah, it's, it's, it's great to see. My, my dogs at home, they're let out five to six times a day. They're walked in the mornings, they're either walked or galloped. But when, when, when we do get to walk or do some work with them, they thrive on it. As you can see with the gallop today, the dogs just go up and around, they love it. I started with about 14 and I'm nearly 80 now. And I'm still going. I find them very interesting and they're a great hobby to have and they're well looked after. Pat, um, He's pushing on a bit now, I suppose. And um, so we meet him, we gallop his dogs from. When he goes racing, we take him in. Uh, we put him in the boxes, we'll trial them. The kids will walk his dogs from. Uh, we help out Pat any way we can. But that's just the Greyhound community for you. We just help one another. The way I am now, I'd say I wouldn't be going out too often. But with the Greyhounds, they're 24 hours a day, seven days a week. They mean a lot to me and to most people who have greyhounds. So you won't find much uh, cruelty within the real greyhound community. So look, yeah, it does. It keeps the likes of pack going and uh, it keeps us going through the COVID. We were out every day with the dogs and it was great. And we were with the kids and, you know, people say they don't see the kids growing up, but look for me, every day with the dogs and the kids, it's, it's everything to us. Jen has two kids there and he's up twice every day with the dogs, like, you know, and the kids love him. So it has to be somebody good for someone. The public's perception of them is wrong. Um, it's not what we do. I go to racing all the time and all my friends, th th none of this happens. People will always tell you that they feed their dogs the best. I uh, mean, the kids had cornflakes this morning. The dogs had sardines, black pudding and honey. So. You know, um, I want to tell people the story, they laugh, but that's, that's the truth with you. They'll, they'll get well looked after and they get well fed. And it's like, it's, it's like having a pet dog. You're not going to do anything bad to a pet dog, are you? Greyhounds are the same, they're no different. Of course, it's frustrating that people uh, think that way, but it's not our way. Definitely not our way. You, you, have, you have it as a hobby, you know? You, you, if you've been thinking you're going to make money, I think you're you're going to be in a bad way, like, you know, you wouldn't last very long in this, you know, they're part of the family. You see, we love our greyhound and I think they're part of our family and, like, I love to go down and rub our dogs, they're really nice to play with. Do you like any other pet, like? Yeah. We have two retired greyhounds at home and we recently just, um, we've rehomed another one. He was a third generation dog at home, we have his mother, we have his grandmother at home. Um, so he's off to Belgium now for a happy life. When, when greyhounds are, are young and, and they don't make the cut, 90% 90, 90 of them make the cut. There's a grade for every greyhound at the moment and a home for every greyhound at the moment. So, so all, all people talking about this and that about greyhounds, there's a home for every greyhound at the moment. What, what else would we do? We love our dogs. We, we have to rehome, we have to look after them. And then it's, it, it's great for somebody else to enjoy them. If anybody has a negative view, just come down to the house and have a look and spend the day with us. Come racing with us and show, uh, we can show them how we appreciate our dogs and how much we love them.